Hi again. Today we will discuss the chart of Cardano and we will analyze which entry point we want to get for this year and and also the year of 2024 and maybe 2000, 2025. Uh, we are looking at a monthly chart. Um, as we see here, we have a fair value gap here, which is filled this month and actually it reacted in a bullish in a bullish way and if we look at daily chart i'll remove this one here and if you look at daily chart we are still under the um 200 exponential moving average which i think we are we are still bearish until we break this moving average here. And also, if we go back to monthly, one of the things that I like to do is always to draw like the volume analysis. And we will see that the most volume is actually here, which is. 0.08 here exactly at this candle i will say this one here this bullish candle this uh, bearish candle sorry so and i will remove this So this one here, which is, as I said before, it's, uh, it's between 0 0.07, which is 7 cents and 10 cents or 12 cents. Here I will buy Cardano or as we said before, if we can see this sh chart this a daily shot if we see that this uh, the price broke the um, the moving average here and maybe do something like this and go back and then i will also i may buy here We also notice that here, this day has a very large volume, but actually this is my favorite point, which is, as I said before, is 10 cents and 8 cents. The idea of the um, volume analysis is actually, um, it's a simple distribution curve it's um, as an example if you want to buy an iphone and we you researched all um uh, let's say websites or stores for price and i will do something like this like this and right here maybe price and here I will write mm, frequency or yeah frequency how many uh, stores are selling for that price so you draw it like this maybe here is you have your price so you'll like you will see the curve maybe like this like this and here will be the most sellers the the price that most sellers are selling for let's say maybe 10k 
in k for iPhone is way too much. Let's say 1k. And some sellers are uh, selling it for more and some sellers are selling it for less. So if you want to buy iPhone, the best way to buy it is actually under that line, which, which means that you buy it lower than 1K. The same idea in, in, in volume analysis. So if we look here and you do it like this, first I will remove drawings. If you do it like this, you'll see that most buyers actually bought at this price. So you don't want to buy it here or here or here or here. The best price to buy is here or even under. But I will be buying here because I don't expect it to go less than eight cents. And eight cents, I, I think it's a fair price for Cardano because actually I will be targeting the next bull run. I will be targeting I use Fibonacci for targeting. So our first profit will be here and I will leave some for maybe here, maybe here and some for five USD. So our position will look like this and I will buy it at eight cents. I will not use stop loss. And as we said, first profit here, it will be around 50 risk to reward. And second profit here, 60 risk to reward ratio. And third profit here, 66 and here at 80 risk to reward ratio so that's it for today follow for more